friends welcome to my channel Indian mom cooking so today I'm going to show you all how to make this easy and simple it at the same time delicious tomato rice at home uh, so let's begin with the video so I always pack this for my kids lunch box and I've taken a kadai in this uh, in that I'm going to add about two tablespoon of oil you can very well add any oil of your choice olive oil refined oil any oil so I'm using your refined oil and to that I'm going to add about one spoon of urad dal and half spoon of mustard seeds make sure to keep the flame on medium otherwise it will get burnt let the mustard seeds pop and urad dal turns it color to brown it just takes about one to two minutes and after that I'm going to add a bunch of curry leaves and I've taken four to five, five cloves of garlic and I've chopped them into fine pieces and I'm going to add that give it a quick stir And at this stage, I'm going to add about two green chilies. So I've cut the green chilies into half. And also one big size onion that are finely chopped. So I finally chopped one big size onion. And I'm going to add them and give it a quick stir again and you need to cook this onion until they become softened or you, you it just uh, takes about three to five minutes and I'm going to add a little bit of salt at this stage so that the onions releases its moisture quicker and uh, it also cooks faster So adding little bit of salt and I'm going to close the lid and cook it for about three to five minutes on medium flame. So it's been three minutes and it, at this stage I'm going to add all the powder masalas so make sure to keep the flame low. Starting off with half spoon of turmeric powder, one spoon of plain chili powder, one spoon of Kashmiri chili powder, one spoon of coriander powder, one spoon of cumin powder and half spoon of pepper powder and a little bit of salt. And these are the basic Indian masalas that I will be adding in all my recipes. And I'm going to add a dash of water so that the masala won't get burnt. Stir it a little and I'm going to cook this for about 3 minutes with the lid closed on medium flame. Or cook it for about 2 minutes on medium flame until the raw smell of the masalas goes off. So yes, the masalas are cooked well. As you can see, the oil oozing out from the onion mixture. And at this stage, I'm going to add about two big sized tomato that are pureed. So I'm just adding half a cup of water. And I'm going to cook this for about five to 10 minutes. And I will be stirring in between in five minutes. So close the lid and cook it for about 10 minutes. Meanwhile, I'll be just deep frying some puppets, which goes really well with this tomato rice. And my kids love to eat this combination. So yes, it's been five minutes. I'm just going to give it a good stir. And again, I'll be cooking for about five more minutes. So yes, it's in total, it has been five, 10 minutes. Now, tomato tukke or takali tukke or tomato gravy is absolutely ready. And at this stage, I'm going to add finely chopped coriander leaves, which gives you a lot of flavor. 
and uh, we are going to make tomato rice out of it so I'm just going to take half the portion and in the same karai I'm going to make the tomato rice so I'm going to add white rice before adding white rice I'm, uh, I'm going to add about one spoon of ghee and followed by rice so I'm just packing uh, my kids lunch box so this is uh, for the person of two so adding the tomato gravy or the tomato tukka and uh, stirring it really well and check for seasoning if you want more salt you can add at this stage and yes this is how we make tomato rice very easy but at the same time delicious to eat so I always pack my kids lunch box along with the puppet or some uh, some sort of puppets so I hope you like this video so if you like it give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my channel if you are new so until next time stay happy so share your recipe through my mail which is in the description box